Oh, I love all green, man. <laughs> Hold on a second. <laughs> Should bring back memories. Hello, folks. What's up? What's going on, people? Yeah. Thought I fell off the map. Thought I got locked up. You thought they locked me up for child support or something? Nope. My kids are grown. Oh, by the way, happy Valentine's Day to all you beautiful ladies out there. I wish I could spread myself around and cook for every one of you beautiful things. But unfortunately, I have to stay home and cook for my wife. Thank you very much. Today is my anniversary. 31 years. I hope I got that right. 31. One woman. Fantastic. A lot of work. A lot of work. But it works. Try me. Hey, I may do a show on that. And I hope you guys cook for your wives, girlfriends, or whatever. None of my business. And I wish I could go out and do these things for you. You know, come in and you can hire me, but I'm too expensive. Hey, hey look here. You hire me, the flowers are out. You're going to end up just, just giving a lot of love and just say, hey, I get it tomorrow because I could break the bank with my fabulous food. All right, today we're going to do a budget here. We're not going to break the bank. Very simple. So you cats, just relax. You know what I mean? You can still buy your beers and all your other stuff too and still get your groove on, okay? Now what we have here, we have broccoli and cauliflower and uh, squash, milk for our mashed potatoes. I have my special slap and seasoning mixing and pepper. Potatoes for, uh, for our mashed potatoes. Of course, the butter for everything here for seasoning and whatnot. I have my Progresso Italian breadcrumbs, which I love dearly. I mean, I like the way it tastes, but if you can't find it, you use the plain stuff. And of course, the, um, they call it chicken tenderloin. All right, what are we gonna do? Very simple. Garlic chicken, mashed potatoes, and vegetables. That's it. Very simple. Okay. Very simple. It's not rocket science. Okay. You guys out there, it's not just about flowers. They can't eat flowers, man. The ladies like to eat. But if I catch any of you clowns in my backyard stealing roses, I do have a pit bull. And a couple of other things that I don't want to talk about right on a second here. You know what I'm saying? A couple of other things that I don't like to talk about on camera. Roasted my garlic, okay? What I'm gonna do with this is I'm gonna saute it in butter, mash it up. I know it's Valentine's Day. I know what garlic does to the breath. But hey, don't worry about that. At least it keeps the vampires away. Now what I'm doing, I'm merging my butter with the garlic. Continue to saute it. As you can see where I'm going with this. It looks crazy right now. But once you put it all together, it will all make sense, okay? Now, the potatoes. I'm gonna peel these things gonna boil it. We'll do about eight potatoes for today. How about that? Is that okay? All right. Okay, now, as you can see, my potatoes are boiling. They're just about done. Okay, four cups of water, eight potatoes, okay? Okay, I drain the water off, off the potatoes, and now I'm gonna mash a little butter, a little garlic, a little milk, Put potatoes in here. Remember the garlic. Remember I roasted it in the oven. Okay. Now I'm gonna slap it in here with these uh, potatoes. Four tablespoons of butter. All right. Now we're gonna put our broccoli. Okay. Here we go. And slap it in here. Four tablespoons of butter. Okay. I have my broccoli, cauliflower, and uh, squash. So, okay, put a little garlic in my veggies. Okay, I take the rest of my roasted garlic, put it on my chicken. Just saturate it with it. Now, roasted garlic to my chicken. Hey, look here, just do your thing. You gotta be no, just get it on there. Just have a good time, mix it up, move it around. Okay, here we go. Bring our breadcrumbs here, bread our chicken. 
Boy, that sounds good. Just look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Right. Isn't that good? Trust me. It's fantastic because I made it. All right. Now, from the stove to the plate. Let's go. So what I'm going to do, I'm done here. I can kick back, sip on my wine, and wait for my lovely wife to come home. But anyway, I want everyone to have a beautiful Valentine's Day. And whatever other occasion, anniversaries, birthdays, anything like that, I hope you have a beautiful, safe evening. And I mean it from the bottom of my heart. But if I catch any new clowns in my backyard stealing roses, <laughs> watch your back. Look around, Chef E in the building.